Hey, this is Caitlin, KS3P. Um, uh, and on my Rock My 20, I just finished installing the U1. Um, and it's a little chip. Um, it has eight leads on it. And it's surface mount technology. Um, to install it, you need a very fine tipped soldering iron. And um, use very little solder because it's very easy to bridge it. And then the instructions say that you should install it first um, uh, because it's very tiny and um, it would be easy to lose it in the other parts or, or it would be hard to see it. Um, and then on the U2 and 3 sockets. Um, uh, they have a little notch on one of their sides. It's silk screened on here, so you need to check to make sure that they're facing the right way. And um, then also, most of the resistors stand up with the gold resist, or um, I'm sorry, tolerance down. Um, I like to keep the tolerance down for neatness, but um, really either way works, so it can be your decision. Um, and then on the diodes and electrolytic capacitor, polarity matters. Um, and then also as I'm building, I like to check off the part on the circuit picture in the inventory sheet. So it's really handy to have a pen or pencil handy and also a highlighter. Um, and then the, as you're building you need to check to make sure that they're in the right spots. So because it can be very easy to make a mistake. And, and then it also takes a while to take it out with solder wick and then find the right hole or flip it in the other direction. So you need to check before you solder things in.